I realized that I'm never going to really impress anybody with my physical stamina, so I got a big truck. How are you doing today? I'm good, how are you? All right, let's go spend some money. All right. Oh, check out the guy behind me standing up on his bike. It's all walking like this. It's like, hey, that guy, that guy's all dressed up for a game of golf, but he's just walking down Virginia Street, like on the phone, like, where's my Uber? So the, the, what I've realized after 53 years is that everybody spends their life in search of what it is they're gonna do, where their greatness is, you know, what they want to be and it's in that search and it's in that that it's not the destination it's the journey and if you can't enjoy the journey then you're missing out on the whole point so appreciate the here and now worry about later later what did you just tell me about a sign oh dude so I got a picture of one of my signs being at an angle uh, it wasn't level and it's not at a 90 degree uh, so that everybody can see it when they drive by. So I've got to go by and um, fix it. <laughs> I gotta remember where it is now. <laughs> Look, we'll stay in the truck. We won't even get out. Look at that. That's textbook real estate signage right there. That's visible. It's visible both ways. Oh, it's got a little bit of a lean to it. Oh, it's got some swag. Just a little bit of swag. You know what that tells me? It's got it going on right there. Mm -hmm. I'll, show, I'll show these guys. Exactly. It's all walking like this. It's like, hey, maybe I want to get these guys though. Maybe I want to get that guy right there. Oh, yeah. That guy. Say, you see me? Oh. Oh, got my level out. Good, yeah? Right side down? Yeah. Right by you. Yeah, that's better. That's more professional. Yeah. That's, professional. that's full service right there. Yeah. I got to make sure I get them sign calls. Can't, can't let those go to waste. You never know. Whoa. Hold on. Hold on, what did I just see? This is how you know you're a real estate geek. Like, whoa, did you just use the 90 degree? Ooh, look at that. That's fancy right there. I just fan got the website. Oh my goodness, man, that's big time. It's showing me up in my own neighborhood. If I could do things differently, when I was younger to now, um, one of the things is I would have paid more attention to the advice that people gave me throughout my lifetime. And instead of seeing it as people trying to tell me that I'm not doing things right, instead take it as constructive criticism and have been open to uh, change or doing things differently because ultimately, People don't necessarily tell you um, to do, they don't give you advice, they don't, they, don't, they don't give you direction to criticize, they give direction to help you be a better person. And it was the insecurities within myself that kept me from seeing that. And the more open I am to growing and learning and seeking advice, um, the more I grow and learn and seek advice. That's the funny thing about this business, man. I guess it's a lot like other businesses, though, where um, you get a community of people that do the same thing. Um, oh, check out the guy behind me standing up on his bike. He's, he's
He's just stretching his legs on huh? Yeah. He's like, whatever. Uh, yeah, the real estate community is funny, and it's not just it's not just in my town. I think it's all over where uh, people tend to think that there is there is a limited amount of success that can be had, and if somebody that competes with them or does the same job as them uh, takes or has success, that there's less for them. And that kind of mentality is really detrimental to, well, to, to any industry or business. And it's really detrimental to one's mental health because if you think of success as something that other people are having and that you can't have it too, um, it's just painful. It just kind of leaves you in a, in a bad place, bad frame of mind. So. Uh, instead, it should be, hey, the people that are being successful or, or having success in whatever industry um, are people that maybe I should model or, or I should ask questions of or that I, I should go and seek advice from. Um, one of the biggest changes for me uh, in, my, in my growth, not just personally but in business, was seeking out mentors that had had success and asking them what I could do differently, what I could, uh, what I could change, or what advice would they give me, things like that, and then being open to it. So, um, ask when you don't know, find others that are being successful, and um, ask them to help you. You'd be amazed how many will. Ooh, this could be fun. Ready? Keep going. Keep going. You're gonna love this. Hi, this is Mike. Hi there, is this Michael? This is Michael. Hi Michael, my name is Nastasia. I'm calling on behalf of Scott Dale from Y Courage Realtors Millennium. How are you doing today? I'm good, how are you? I'm great, thank you so much for asking. So Scott is the broker here and he asked me to reach out to you as he wanted to share what he could offer if you might consider moving to his brokerage. Oh, does he have a brokerage Scott, in my town? Um, well, there are over 550 offices in the US and oh. he's also uh, have a Nevada office okay. at uh, Beltway and uh, Decatur. Okay, in Las Vegas? Yes, Las Vegas. Perfect, right down the road from me. Sorry? I said right down the road from me. Oh, yeah, okay. Right, so if he's able to present you with a better offer than what you have now, would you at least consider switching brokerages in the near future? Um, if he's willing to offer, actually, I'm not. No. No, you wouldn't. No. If okay. He, I'll tell All you right. what. I, if he offers me a million dollars cash one-time payment and 100% of my money I get to keep, I would have a conversation with him. Okay, I will definitely let him know that. Okay. Oh, that's perfect. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Thank you. Happy Thank day. Thank you. You too. Bye bye. Bye bye. Know your worth. That's what I'm saying. I want to be great at lip sync. That's what I want to be great at. <laughs> Just sing country songs. Yeah.